Welcome to Tennis Spin, where we put our spin on your tennis. Preparation is a big part of tennis. I'm not talking about what you do or whatever before you play, but preparing for your shot, right? Stay tuned. All right, coffee sponsor of today is my buddy who hooked me up with this bag. I think it's from the Hawaiian Islands. It is from Oahu, my buddy Glenn. Glenn Almadova walked in here and handed me this and said, what do you think? Some sexual chocolate for you? I'm like, okay, thank you. I guess that's some kinky stuff. I'll... Uh, I guess I'll grind it up and give it a shot. All right. Thank you, Glenn. I know you are in the middle or actually just finished your knee replacement. So hopefully you're healing well and hopefully on the court real soon. Okay. They've done wonders on knee replacements. You literally walk out of that surgery the next day or the same day is what I'm hearing now. Like walk out, knee replacement. Yeah. Uh, crazy. I'm probably heading there myself, but you know, I'm trying to hold on to it as long as I can. Those of you who've done it, you know what I'm talking about. All right. So if you want to be my coffee sponsor of the day, network is buymeacoffee.com forward slash tennis spin. If you want to support the channel, super thanks is the way. Link is below and you can support our ongoing tennis content. All right, so today, you know, I have many questions about preparing. I mean, I have the same problem myself because, you know, my long days here standing around stringing, pre preparing, like literally I'm just standing there waiting for the ball to come over and, oh, okay, ball's coming, rack it back, and then... I go through. So I, what happens when I do this? I'm late. <laughs> I'm slapping at the ball. How can we prepare to hit the ball faster? How do we like condition our minds to prepare faster? Coach Rob actually had a great suggestion. So we're going to actually go out and give it a shot right now. See you on the court. Uh. <laughs> Sorry. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> We had it. We had it for a little while. We had it for a minute. One, two. <laughs> Oops. I was looking for the ball. But it kind of changes your senses, huh? Yeah. It makes you like prepare faster. Right. You don't have all day all of a sudden. Right. Ah, so oh, cute. Sorry. <laughs> All right, coach, so I, I get it. I get it now. It, I've never in my life heard of a two ball 
rally. Right. Um, this is the first time I've heard of it and have done it. I, in my mind, I was like, there's no way you can do that. <laughs> but, <laughs> you just did. <laughs> right. But I, if you keep it in, uh, like not hitting as hard as you can and just right. trying to keep the ball rolling, right. a medium speed yep. to low speed, you could definitely keep a ball r rally going. Yeah, definitely. Makes you move your feet, makes you get ready a little sooner, makes you uh, hit and be ready for the next ball because you know it's coming. Because <laughs> yep. you hear it, you're like, oh, he already hit it. I got to get ready for the next one. Right. And uh, yeah, it just changes it up a little bit. Yeah, no problem. Have, how many times have you used this before? Do you use it all season yeah. long, the girls, Yeah, the mix boys? it in now and then. When I see them, you know, they kind of got a little low energy or something. You're just like, come on, here we go. You, you sneak another ball in in the drills. All of a sudden, they're like, what? You didn't tell me there was another one. I'm like, hey, come on, pay attention. Let's go. Oh. Wake up. So, Coach Rob, actually, we, we did that for, a f you know, a few rallies, maybe a little more than that. And then we went back to one ball, and I was like, as soon as I hit the ball, I was like, okay, where's the ball? Where's the ball? Right. And then so I'm prepared now for to one ball now, not right. the two balls. But when you went back to one ball, were you thinking about what you were doing or looking for the next ball coming at you? I was looking for the next right. ball that's coming you at me. You were staying out of your own head. You're like, hey, I got to hit ready to hit the next ball. Let's go. What's coming? Right. You know? Right. So that's a great drill for preparation for sure, just to... Maybe you had a long day at school. Maybe you had a long day at work. Maybe you just had a long day. Maybe you had a long night. <laughs> <laughs> just to change it up, have a little fun. Doesn't mean yeah. you gotta do it a long time, but right, right. you know, mix just, it in. Just to kind of get the blood rolling with the two balls and you know, get your legs moving, get your brain working, and you maybe get your brain out of the equation and get it on the ball on the itself. Ball. Find the ball. Yeah. Yep. Ah, Coach Rob always comes up with these cool drills. Thank you, Coach <laughs> sure, Rob. Sure, that's fun. All right. Guys, thank you for watching Tennis Spin, where we put our spin on your tennis. Oh! I got you, Rob, buddy. Look, I got you, Rob. Oh, man. I got you, Rob. I got you, Rob. Thank you for... Thank you for the weekly lesson, dude. Here, oh, back up. Again. I got you, Rob. I got you, Rob. I got you, Rob. Now, if you want a patient pro just like Coach Rob, hey, play your court is the place. The, your pro can come to you, right? They can come out to your site. All you need to do is go to playercourt.com. You can even get a discount there. Playercourt.com forward slash tennis spit. Harry, are you sure you're right-handed?